It's known as brain drain, a common phenomenon in developing countries when educated people find better opportunities elsewhere. In Peru, top scientists are leaving because of the lack of funding in science and technology research. The government is trying to reverse all of that. Dan Collins reports. Ask any Peruvian scientist or doctor where they studied, and the answer will likely be here, Cayetano Heredia University. But many will have continued postgraduate studies outside the country. Inadequate facilities, few teaching posts, and low pay pushed generations of Peruvian scientists abroad. But now, for the first time in a long time, the situation is improving, and Peru is tempting back its talent. Peru's Council for Science and Technology is funding 260 master's degrees for Peruvian students complete with salaries. It's also paying for more than 100 students to pursue doctorate degrees abroad. We are going to make an open competition to labs and scientists abroad for Peruvians and foreign scientists uh, and we will give them um, a nice salary yeah, but also uh, startup money no, of around 100,000 US dollars uh, for, for a, an initial project. So we hope that with that they will feel attracted to come here. Previous governments invested just 0.1% of GDP in science and technology, or Heda tells CCTV. So Peru is playing catch up. Previous governments in Peru didn't realize the the impact that science can have in the development of a country. But this government apparently does. President Ollanta Humala has quintupled funding and says he wants to create a SciTech ministry before he leaves office. Incentives are key, says Armando Valdez, a Peruvian biologist who returned. If you are going to promote students, young scientists, to go somewhere else, Europe, US, Japan, Asia, to go out there and, and learn something and come back, the moment you start giving them the chance to go out, you have to think that you want them to return. If Peru can create the right conditions for science to flourish, it might just turn its brain drain into brain gain. Dan Collins, CCTV, Lima.